Hey everybody, it's just Vaughn E2. I'm back and we're uh we're recording. Let's see. Headed this way. I hope we're recording, otherwise this is gonna be really awkward. But we're on our way to the Museum of Technologically. Which is a very, very scientificated place, is so I'm told. Uh I remember uh Back when I got this game, I was uh, utterly convinced that this was the best video game that had ever been created. And that, you know, all other video games would be... I'm over encumbered. Just a pale... well, at least first-person shooters would be a pale shadow of Fallout 3. Now I'm under the uh, assumption that it's a pretty good game. That's it, for the most part. I don't need a nail board. What else should I get rid of? And it's a very good game. I'm not gonna lie. It's still one of my favorite games, or I wouldn't be playing this right now, because it would be really stupid to be playing a game that's, you know, it's mediocre at best, but I figured I'd play it for you guys. It's a fucking hate you. What the hell type of logic would that be? Nah, I like you guys. I want to do things you'll enjoy. Shotgun shells. Thank you. Uh, I'm looking forward to Borderlands 2, though, because it came out not too, uh, not too long after Fallout 3. And there were a lot of people who were going, you know, Borderlands, you mean Fallout lands, different graphics. These weren't very smart people, is what I'm trying to say. They were internet people. Not like you, though. You're internet people, but you're all smart. I know you. Yes, that's ass-kissing. Or at least backpedaling. But, um... Damn it. There you know, but I'm looking forward to this. It's gonna be awesome. I'm wondering if I'll get any special hats for Team Fortress 2. It seems like the sort of thing for which I would get hats. And they they do enjoy the hats. I'm gonna take Alright, I, I don't play Team Fortress 2 that off often. But I do enjoy the hell out of it. And I do get a chance to play it, because it's more of a Gee, when can I get a chance to play it for, you know, like a drop? Is that... Ooh, I level up. Let's see. Aha. Alright, do I want more energy weapons? More energy weapons might be a good idea, but I... I think I'm gonna put them in repair for now. Alright, let's see. What can I take? I've got... What's educated give me? I think... Oh, that's the one I should have taken last level. But, we'll take that. Come on here. I love poo balls. That's pool pool balls, not poo balls, as I just said. That's pretty horrifying. But yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to that. I also recently uh, purchased Gary's mod for personal enjoyment. You don't expect lasers to be better than a hockey mask. I mean, except for the one that you know, Jason uses in uh, Friday the 13th. Oh my, we're gonna die. Let's uh, get some of those stim packs as quickly as possible. And kill that fucker. Yes. Yes, good. Now stop with the vats, please, because he's still shooting at me. Oh, but, uh, um, yeah. Gary's mod is a very interesting little game. As most of you have probably heard of it by now. I know I've got one or two, uh, there's you don't pay too much attention, but it's a sort of make whatever the hell you want simulator for a much more um what's what I'm looking for? I'm completely out of stim packs, so this could go poorly. Yeah, it's a build whatever the fuck you want simulator for a system or for the source engine, like half life and whatnot. Do I have anything that heals? Anything, anything at all that heals. Uh buff out, I'll take one of those. A jet. Damage resistance, uh, I'll eat, take half of my nuka colas, uh, and then I'll take a rat away. There's a good chance we're gonna end up hardly addicted to something here. God, can it, oh, thank god she died. And then flew through the air for no discernible reason. Well, at least she was majestic. Good lord. 
the second I can get outside, I'm going to need to... Wow, I'm almost out of our ammo for this thing. Uh, let's see. I'll take all those new Coca-Colas. Always new Coca-Cola. Uh, what other guns do I have? Because I need something else. Uh, 35 mm pistol, submachine gun is okay, but it uses a lot of ammo. Uh, I can use the fat man. No, the health. Looks like it might need a sawed off shotgun for a while. That's going to require close, uh, close quarters contact. Can I? Yes. The assault rifle is also a pretty good bet. Alright, let's see what's over here. Nothing. You know what would be awesome? A goddamn medicine bottle. Beer and wine. A beer and wine, not what I had in mind. They're not exactly medicine. What's that? Uh, oh great, two, plung two plungers and a sensor module. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Uh, but, um, let me see. What the hell is it? The Gary's Mod is basically any Source Engine game, like Team Fortress 2, or, um... Half-Life 1, Half-Life 2, Half-Life Your Mother. It'll use the sprites and graphics from them, and it's a sort of... I don't know, people use it for all sorts of different things. There are generic sandbox worlds where you can build whatever the hell you want. There's ones where, uh... You have to... There are all sorts of weird mission ideas. Like, there's one called Trouble in Terrorist Town, I think. Where you end up playing either Innocence a detective or a terrorist or traitor whatever it is and uh, you have to figure out who the terrorists are without killing any innocents or at least as few as possible because from what I've heard you just at some point just start murdering people and hoping for the best which is usually how these things go but I got it I actually got it for uh, myself because I almost never do shit like that or get anything for me, but I figured it would also be fun to record at some point. Hi. Oh, that worked. That worked very well. Huh. I'll take that air ammo. Right. Oh, there's someone over there. Well, that's okay, because I'm headed this way. See you later. I don't really need to deal with you right now, considering how near death I am. Well, maybe I can ambush you. Can I ambush him? And it doesn't even look like he's fucking coming this way. To hell with that. Here it was. I laid an ambush for him. I was expecting, you know, at least the decency of his coming to try and murder me, but no. He's like, bye. Energy cells. Jets. Motherfucker. When I lay a trap for you, I expect you to accept it and be civil. I'm going to shoot you right in your stupid head. Oh, that was a good stupid headshot. You know what I'll take? Well, not do this. Healing item? No. Fuck you. Seriously, fuck you. I hate these guys. They're so inconsiderate. And seriously. Missile. Missiles are good. Missiles are worth money. Seriously, these guys, they're, they're so goddamn inconsiderate. Alright. Run to the Mall of America. The first thing I need to do... Alright. There's a super mutant over there. That probably means that I can't warp anywhere. Let's find out. Yes, I'm gonna have to try and kill that guy. Let's do a little save first. Alright, where is our target? Maybe I can get closer towards it. What is even angry at me, dammit? I made it to the Museum of Tech. Where the hell is it? I don't even see the fucking thing. Oh, fuck. Fuck you. Fuck the master. Fuck this super mutant dumbass head. And that's right, it's an asset. Fuck my hand to reload. Alright, we need to get back to Megatina. 
quickly. Yes, thank you. Because we need to sell a lot of resources. And see what we can buy. Um, so a lot of stuff that is worn off. Let's go see the doctor. About not death. It's important to talk to the doctor about not death. Is that you? Yes. I'm Doc Church, and I run this. Yeah, if I know. You do bother me. Follow you hate everyone. I'm hurt. I need help. Oh. Heal me up first. You all right up there? The hell? Need another painkiller? Oh, it's good to know that you're just solving my problems with painkillers. That is probably what I would. All done. right, that should. There's something else I needed. All right, medical supplies. Yes, I want to buy. How? Oh, I can't buy all those. Let's sell you so, or give you some weapons that uh, you probably don't need. Switchblade. Keep that power armor. That's nice power. Yeah. Psycho. I'll keep the rad X right away. Um, keep those hollow tag. Conductors, please. Uh, lawnmower blade. Damn. Actually. Good lord. I'm not going to be able to get all of those things, but. What do I have I don't need? Um, flamer fuel. I'm probably, damn it, probably never going to use a flamer. Uh, missiles. Um, uh, I will definitely end up with, you know what? I'll give him two and take his money. Because I'm never going to use the fat man, let's be honest here. It is just death. Using the fat man is asking to die. You done? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. And by go ahead, I meant to say go to hell, but I said the wrong things entirely. Because I'm retarded, apparently. And I'll keep my good laser, or one of the laser pistols. And, uh. Put the rest of the stuff in. I haven't put anything in there. No, good. Now, let's see. We'll put the fat man, because that's a lot of weight keep the, or put the better laser pistol in that in there, and the powered armor. There we go. Now let's see if anyone's opened up the door to the Sims house yet. Yep, there you go. Look at me. Ooh. <laughs> oh lord. You know, ever notice how no one in these games is ever touching the ground? I mean, I mean obviously you do, but you know the hell up. No, what I mean, your feet are not actually coming into any contact with the ground. There's no actual friction. You're kind of hovering above the ground. Damn it. Stop that shit. Alright. Now, your feet are basically hovering a few inches above the ground, and that's how you move. Oh, boy. Hi. Now I'm just gonna get closer and shoot you, because... That, uh, need that bonus. There we go. Let's start collecting valuable stuff again. We need it. Because we need more weapons, and that wasn't really valuable. Oh, well. We'll drop it off somewhere. There's bound to be corpses in here. Alright. For fuck's sake. Ah, damn it. Die. Um, well, I'm always amused how it seems that, um, it seems that these, you know, old-fashioned, you know, bullet-fired rifles never do as, or somehow do more damage than, uh, laser weaponry. This makes me wonder, are they really the future? And the answer is no, probably not. Let's see, what does that do? 14, that is 16. Alright. Well, that's a good secondary when we need it. There's also stealth boys. There's a quite a number of stealth boys throughout here. And all the collapsed bits. I'd like to see, like, a fan-made mod uh, project thing. Where, um... What's the word I'm looking for? 
they redid the entire insides of these things. I mean, I know that'll never happen. Because that is way too big of an undertaking. But that would be pretty awesome. Museum information. What? Oh yeah, these things. There's a long series of them where if you get them all right, you can get a really, really good gun at some point later at a late... There might be some, even some location later in the game. I do not remember what the uh, answers were. I'm not going to claim to be. Oh, yeah, the vault thing. I freaked out there for a moment. Let's see some snack here. Ah, yes. It's actually pretty smart. Oh god, horrible noise. No, oh, they're right. Safety, survivability, and sanitation. These are three really important things. Where is... Only a projected 2% failure rate. That's good to know. There's just a hundred vaults about the country, or a hundred or more vaults around the country. And it's also good to know. Right. Oh yeah, and these are kind of neat. The living sections make use of our revolutionary floor sock auto cleaner system for those darned messy Floor kids. sock. Never sweep again. Doesn't work here though, I don't think. And... Janitor, and a beer, and iguana bits. Now you see what worries me there is that this guy appears to have been the janitor. And, you know, the janitor during the apocalyptic war, and he had a beer and iguana bits on a stick. Moms will love how our Culinator 3000 kitchen system makes cooking a breeze. Mmm, I can smell the muffins baking now. Yeah, that sounds great. No one cares. Or don't be. Step into our Entertainatron room and watch the latest holotapes, or perhaps listen to a symphony. Good to know that Another Vault Tech innovation. Yay, Vault Tech! It's a wave of the future. Security. Our eye on you cameras mm. enable the Vault Leader to watch your every move. You'll never be alone again. Where is that camera they were just talking about? Ah, yeah. Let me zoom in. I was hoping to be able to get like. A shot of what they said. Anyway, I like the Vault Tech stuff. It's always neat. I'd like to see an entirely functional Vault Tech. Yeah, because the thing is, the vaults are supposed to house like 1,500 or in some cases even 15,000 people. And uh, they never show you all of the vault. They don't. It's kind of. They'd be kind of huge, like they filled in, you know, in New Vegas they mentioned, oh yeah, they filled in the vault. It's because they probably didn't want to go to the trouble of designing all of it. Vertebird prototype, yes. A toy vertebird, basically. Well, a model of one. But, um, yeah, they never show you all of one. I think they should. I'd love to see how expensive it is. In another Fallout game, that might be really cool. You know, like if they do do a Fallout online. Let's see. I'm supposed to find I think the dishes at the bottom here. Yeah, I'll wait here. Hopefully, they'll come around that corner there. Come on. Damn it. Hi. Come on, just, just die. Die in the face. Die in the face. Alright. Come on. I'm gonna grab all this and run around the corner. Let me see. Can I do anything with, like, the hunting rifles I have? I meant more combine them to get more money for them later. Well, they're, they're worth a decent amount. Re re repair, so. I guess it's out a worthwhile endeavor. Yeah, there's one up here, isn't there? 
Yep. Please die on me. Please you die on me. Alright. Always new Coca Cola. I keep saying that. I'm not sure Coca Cola would like that. You know. He hears something. I wonder if it could have been all those gunshots or the sound of his friend's heads exploding. Probably not. Let's uh, stim myself up some packs. Yeah, well. Alright, anyway, this is actually where I'm going to call it. But I'll be back next, uh, or I'll be back on Monday with more. So, till then, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and peace out.